So in Massachusetts, there's a lot of questions about guardianships and standards of proof in once a guardianship takes place. Uh, if uh, a parent uh, seeks to vacate or get rid of the guardianship, um, there's been a little bit more clarification under the law uh, about who has the burden of proof. And right now, it appears that there's an, the parent just needs to make like an initial showing to show the change in circumstance to show why the guardianship should not be in place. And then what ends up happening is the, uh, if, that, if the parent's able to make that initial burden, then the guardian has to satisfy the reason to keep the guardianship in place. So it's a little bit complicated because there two, there's two prongs to it. Again, the parent needs to make the initial showing and then the guardian needs to satisfy the guardianship in the same way that, that he or she did at the beginning of the case and has the burden of proof.